Yo, what is going on YouTube? What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for tuning in today, man. Today, we're checking out Zager and Evans again with In The Year 2525. Now, I did do a reaction to the studio version and I was asked to check out this live actually it was a studio version but i think they had them playing on stage on the video uh but i was told that there is a really good video uh to check out right here uh let me go ahead and see real quick yeah so it says that the scenes are from a sci-fi film metropolis so i don't know if that's gonna get copyrights uh on youtube and i'm gonna have to work around it somehow because i don't know how that works if it has movie scenery in it uh film you know real in it so let's go ahead and just see how it goes so if it's edited by in any way where the picture is distorted for you guys i'm sorry just know i'm actually watching it in the original content but hopefully it'll just let me upload to youtube without any issues so we'll see what happens by the time you guys are viewing this all right so zager and evans in the year 2025 20, uh 25 25 i loved the idea of the song the first time we checked it out so i'm excited to see it in the context of the imagery that we will get on screen but the song i love a song like this man it's got meaningful lyrics it's kind of looking into the future saying hey we're kind of doomed if we don't turn this ship around a little bit um so i like that man just because as we see i feel like times are always doomed you got to think back to like caveman days people are like beating each other senseless to to um you know gain property and and territory you could imagine has that ever truly changed no uh, man is just as stupid today as we were in caveman days, okay? Uh, maybe we've got some techno technological advancements that are cool, um, but as far as the bare bones of us, man, do have we ever really grown out of beating each other to a pulp to claim something? It appears not. So let's go ahead and dive in, learn a little bit more about this one, and, and enjoy the video, all right? Appreciate y'all tuning in today. Let's hit play, see what's going on. In the year 2525, if man is still alive, if woman can survive, they may find. Mmm, love it, dude. In the year 35, 35, ain't gonna need to tell the truth, tell no lies. Everything you think, do, and say is in the pill you took today. In the year 45, 45, ain't gonna need your teeth, won't need your eyes. You won't find a thing to chew, nobody's gonna look at you. In the year 55, 55 Your arms are hanging limp at your sides Your legs got nothing to do Some machine doing that for you In the year 65, 65 Ain't gonna need no husband, won't need no wife You pick your son, pick your daughter too from the bottom of a long glass tube, whoa, whoa. Oh, these lyrics, dude. In the year 7510, if God's a coming, he ought to make it by then. Maybe he'll look around himself and say, Guess it's time for the judgment day. In the year 8510, Say I'm pleased where man has been Or tear it down and start again whoa, whoa. In the year 95, 95 I'm kind of wondering if man is gonna be alive He's taken everything this old earth can give And he ain't put back nothing Whoa, whoa now it's been 10,000 years Man has cried a billion tears For what he never knew Now man's reign is through But through eternal night The twinkling of starlight So very far away Maybe it's only yesterday In the year 2525 if man is still alive, if woman can survive, they may fall. Ah, 
This song's fire, dude. I think I remember here reading a comment that uh, this song didn't quite hit somebody. They didn't really care for. I'm like, man, I don't know. I'm vibing with it, man. I love the message. I love the feeling of the music. I love when the music fits the message. I'm very simple. <laughs> now, I say simple. That is a very difficult task, right? I mean, this is creativity at work, man. These are people who are, um, yeah, I mean, they're they're really creating something here. I believe somebody also told me, was it Zager had a style of acoustic guitar or something? So he's been successful in selling guitars. Unless I'm getting the artist confused, very well might have be the case i think i've reacted to like over 1400 uh songs on this channel so from here and there i am definitely going to be making mistakes um so feel free to butcher me in the comments if i do that uh yeah with this one though um it hits man it hits the message hits very much so because the way i see it there is going to be an end of days you know eventually maybe it's not going to be any time in my lifetime maybe it's going to be hundreds of years from now but at some point at some point People who are alive in that space and time, they're going to have to deal with the final results that many of us might be gone by the time that happens. And it just, if you're connected, if you're empathetic, if you feel for people who you don't necessarily have to be in their shoes, it, it hurts. It hurts to think that at some point, the, the situation, these people, these beings, these conscious um, people will be in at that state and time. Because you might have feared it in your lifetime, if not people around you feared it. Maybe at points in our life right now, we're fearing it. But to pass away one day and maybe not have to face the full uh, repercussions of the actions of hundreds of years of turmoil and, and craziness. Well, maybe we were the lucky ones to not have to be on that blunt end. Um, and I feel bad because I'm talking on a global scale, but people are facing that every day. Right now, as we're comfortably sitting here, I'm comfortably sitting here re recording a video and somebody was comfortably sitting there watching a video. People are literally having their end of days in this moment fighting for survival. It's crazy. It's sad. It's messed up. It's an ugly place. And that's why this song hits, too, is like, yeah, I'm looking at the broader picture just like the, the artist did. But the doomsday that we fear people are facing every day. We're fortunate, we're privileged to not be in that situation. And that's crazy. It's crazy. Um, I'm talking about literally cavemen antics and the way that, you know, this I beat you, you beat me, uh, it happens, but we're, it's not our reality. But it is someone's reality right now. And one day it's going to be the reality of the globe. It's crazy. It's crazy. I like thinking about that stuff and I wish... Um, you know, we I wish we had a button just change it all, man, and make everybody, hey, let's come to an understanding. Just sucks it can't happen. But this song definitely makes me think, obviously. So um I'm thankful I'm safe. I'm thankful my family's safe. I'm thankful all of you are safe enough to be able to enjoy uh the life in the world the way we do and not have to face those brutal truths out there. And hopefully we're all doing what we can to contribute to making other people's lives better. All right. I mean that's that's a good way to spend our freedom and, and to enjoy enjoy life the way it's been given to us is by hopefully sharing some good into other people. And maybe that's, I mean, what, what more can you do than hope that that's going to be enough to make an impact, man? Good stuff. Sorry, I went off on a ramble, guys. Appreciate y'all suggesting me onto this one. I'm definitely a talker sometimes, so sorry about that. Thank you guys for tuning in. Love you guys, man. Have a great one. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.